We are so happy to be coming home. We thought the journey was ending, but we didn't know that a new adventure was just beginning. In the last episode, we visited some historical places in Cebu and met new friends on this wonderful island. At the airport, we noticed some colorful ukuleles. Some of them have beautiful paintings of animals that are found in Cebu and others have the Philippine flag on them. Our very own ah. ukuleles. Nice. Thank you so much. Thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> we chose the one with the Philippine flag on it. Мы купили сувенир, акулеле, которую делают в Сибу, здесь же настроен на производство. Замечательный инструмент, я должен обязательно научиться на нем играть. На нем четыре струны, в отличие от гитары, там шесть, семь. На гитаре я уже умею играть, теперь надо переучиться на акулеле. <laughs> ну а мы с Дарлин отправляемся обратно в Давао. Мы прекрасно провели время здесь в Сибу. Нам все очень понравилось. Это наш багаж. We check into our flight and we think that in less than an hour we will board a plane that will take us to Davao. But suddenly I hear an announcement that our flight is full. The airline is looking for eight passengers from our flight to take the next flight to Davao. Volunteers will get a ticket to the next flight, 3,000 pesos each, and free round-trip tickets to any domestic destination in the future. I jokingly suggested to Boria that we volunteer, and I am very surprised that he agreed. <laughs> Maybe we're sleeping. We're sleeping in the hotel and <laughs> The staff told us that the next flight to Davao is through Clark Airport. That means we will fly from Cebu to Luzon and then to Mindanao. A long trip, but we're up for the adventure. We doubted if it was all real until airline staff handed us the money and new tickets. Да, мы отправляемся в Кларк. Это не входило в наши планы. Ну вот такой счастливый день у нас сегодня. Приключения. Приключения. Our situation reminded me of one of my favorite series called Manifest. It's a story of a family coming home from vacation. A brother and sister, like us, volunteered to take the next flight in exchange for $400. And the rest of the family stayed on the previous flight. The plane the brother and the sister were on went missing and they were presumed dead. But five years later, the missing plane suddenly landed at the airport. Although it seemed to the passengers that only a few hours had passed. In those five years, the world has changed 
and everything around them is different. We look out the window and are mesmerized by the islands floating below. If I didn't know it is a tropical country, I might think that they were covered in snow. After a while, the tropical islands began to remind me of steam trains. They too let out big fluffy puffs of steam. The temperature over the islands is usually higher than over the ocean. It is because they are heated by sunlight faster than the ocean. The warm, moist air rises upward. There, the water vapor cools to the dew point and turns into beautiful clouds. I remember what Slava Kurilov wrote in his book, Alone in the Ocean, how he sailed towards the clouds because he was sure there would be an island there. Очень интересно. Я не понимаю, почему сверху серые облака, а под ними белые. Ведь солнце-то светит сверху, а получается верхние облака как будто в тени. So later, we landed in Clark Pampanga. I am so excited because it's been a long time since we've been in Luzon. My family lives three hours away, but we don't have enough time to visit them today. Where we go? Go to. Умные эскалаторы. Включается только тогда, когда подходишь к ним. О. So <laughs> И поехали. <laughs> we froze in amusement as we entered the airport building. I think it is the most beautiful airport we have seen in the Philippines. The wooden roof elements create a warm, cozy atmosphere. Я зашел сюда и чувствую, что здесь пахнет деревом. Все конструктивные вот эти элементы крыши сделаны из дерева, стропила, вот эти несущие. Очень толстые. Да, прям красота. Clark International Airport has earned worldwide recognition of one of the most beautiful airports in the world. Despite being one of the largest airports in the Philippines, it is quiet. There are several cafes and fast food restaurant on the fourth floor. Our next flight will be a few hours away and we have time to eat and look around. Funny thing is, we had breakfast in Visayas, lunch in Luzon, and we'll have a dinner in Mindanao. Я продолжаю рассматривать конструкцию крыши, 
очень интересно для меня. Я думаю, что древесина здесь используется елка. Может быть сосна, но похоже больше на елку. Passengers headed to the gate. We followed them too. Finally, we are allowed to board the plane. Why are you laughing, baby? Because <laughs> we are in Luzon and he, he greeted the security guard. <laughs> Bori and I look out the window of the second airplane this day. I think this year has been a very good year for us. We traveled to different parts of the Philippines and met many wonderful people. We are excited to share our adventures with you. The sky quickly turned from bright blue to a beautiful shade of gray and total darkness. The twinkling lights below look like thousands of stars. Davao City is beautiful even at night. You could see by our faces how tired we were, but it was a wonderful trip. Our suitcases that went with us on an unexpected adventure also safely arrived in Davao. We hurriedly headed to the bus stop. Hopefully, it is not too late and there will be some passing bus to Mako. Мы вышли на дорогу, надеемся, что-нибудь поймаем. Бутуан. Why not? Several buses passed by, but we could only take them to Tagum. Well, we've had to take a connecting bus. Проехал сейчас мимо автобус на Мате. Вот. Был, наверное, полный и не остановился. Вот мы с, Тагу... мы с Дарлин думаем, что, наверное, все-таки поедем до Тагум, а там пересядем до Мака. Так будет быстрее. А то нам придется стоять еще неизвестно сколько, если автобусы в Мате будут проходить мимо. We got into a minivan and headed to the city of Tagum. It's not very convenient to shift our suitcases and backpacks every time. But the important thing is that we're going home. We then transferred to a multicab. The trip will only take half an hour. We were already halfway through the trip when the multicab suddenly stopped in the middle of the road. Остановились между Тагумом и Мака, потому что или закончился бензин, или что-то сломалось. 
В общем, приключения у нас не закончатся сегодня, наверное. Наш багаж э, где-то стоит там на крыше. Надеюсь, еще стоит. Вот, я попросил, чтобы его там привязали. It turned out we were out of gas. Our luggage is lying on the roof of the multicab, waiting to be rescued. The dashboard of the multicab has many different lighted instruments, like an airplane. They probably show altitude, pressure, cloud cover, anything but the amount of fuel in the tank. It's a good thing the problem wasn't serious. We're glad we ran out of gas on the ground instead of in the air. We were saved by the gasoline in a bottle. <laughs> sorry, 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 you got uh, empty. Oh, <laughs> empty, oh. empty. No more gasoline. It's Coca-Cola. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Red, 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 red. Once again, Borja was convinced that bottled gas stations in the Philippines are very useful and convenient. Soon, to the cheers of the passengers, our car came to life. My husband and I wondered if today had been a lucky or unlucky day. We were tired, but we are very happy to be home safe and sound. Наконец-то мы добрались домой. Без приключений у нас не обходится. Да, мы приехали, наверное, часов на 10 позже, чем от намеченного первого рейса. Вот, но зато у нас теперь есть несколько тысяч песо и билеты, куда мы хотим полететь на Филиппины вот, и обратно. Получается, 4 билета будет. Are you glad? I don't know. <laughs> it's an interesting adventure, but it's so exhausting and nervous and uh, everything already <laughs> so but it's hmm. but that's good it's good yeah we have we... four ticket <laughs> now yeah yeah and we can go wherever we want in philippines yeah so <laughs> yeah. but we have something to eat i'm hungry <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> and we don't have any food because we ate everything before we before we went to Cebu. Oh, yeah. I don't know. We don't have anything. Okay. I don't know. I'll just drink water. Water. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> See you See soon. You soon. <laughs> In the next episode. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy <Bye>. birthday. <laughs>